Hello, and welcome to the twelfth day of our 40 Days of the Cross video series. Each day we're taking just a few minutes to look at a word which will help us better understand the meaning of the cross. Today's word is grace. When we're reading a story or watching a movie, we'll often see a character do terrible things. That's the bad guy. And what we want to happen is for the bad guy to get what's coming to him. We want the bad guy to be punished. In the 1986 movie The Mission, the bad guy is a slave trader named Mendoza in 18th century South America. He's capturing men and women and children from the indigenous tribes in the jungle, and then he's selling them into slavery. We as the audience want him punished, maybe even killed, but in a major twist, Mendoza becomes a Christian. He asks the priest who is a missionary to the indigenous tribes for penance. And Mendoza's punishment is to drag a heavy bag of old rusty armor through the jungle, up the waterfall, to the village where he must present himself to the tribe that he had persecuted. As Mendoza and the priests climbed the mountain that led them to the village, the villagers saw them coming. And one of the village leaders asked the priest why this man was dragging this heavy weight by himself. The priest said that he was being punished for his sin. What was his sin, the village leader asked. The priest told him that this was the man who had kidnapped, beaten, and sold his people. Well, a villager pulled out his machete and ran down to the former slave trader. He began to scream at Mendoza in a language Mendoza did not know. Then he took his machete and cut the rope holding the bag which went tumbling down the mountain. The priest said to Mendoza, He has forgiven you and released you from your burden. Mendoza sank to the ground and began to weep. This was an act of grace. Instead of getting what he deserved, he got what he needed. The cross was an act of grace. In this case, we were the bad guy. It was we who deserved the punishment for the sins of our words, our actions, and our thoughts. There was no penance that could be paid that would remove our sins. So Jesus took the punishment for us. He didn't give us what we deserved. He gave us what we most needed. That is grace. That is what Jesus' death on the cross did for us. That grace gave us atonement. We'll talk more about atonement tomorrow. I want to encourage you to take a little time to meditate on the grace of the cross after we pray today. Heavenly Father, there is a reason we call your grace amazing. We stand amazed that you would give us what we needed instead of what we deserved. Thank you for the cross of grace. In the name of Jesus, your Son, amen. Thanks for listening, everybody. Please take some time to pray and meditate on how the, the cross shows God's grace.